Today I will be talking about logos versus symbols. A logo is a visual representation of a brand or company. A logo is instantly recognizable and it is used in advertising and marketing to increase brand awareness. So as soon as you see this symbol, what comes to your mind? Apple. So everyone knows that this symbol stands for Apple, the company. This one, most people can recognize as Facebook. Symbols are a visual representation of an idea. So these are also instantly recognizable. However, they are used as a universal picture to communicate ideas. So when you see this image, what comes to your mind? You might have thought of love. When you see this image, what comes to your mind? Peace. So symbols communicate ideas versus logos that are used for advertising to increase brand awareness. So logos and symbols both make ideas or a company more universal. This means you do not have to translate them into different languages. So everyone can see and recognize a picture better than words because pictures you do not have to translate. They also allow us to communicate our interests without using words. The phrase, a picture is worth a thousand words, comes to mind when thinking about this. You can use symbols to describe your interests. Brainstorm ways that you could describe, demonstrate an interest. For example, music. There are multiple symbols that come to mind when thinking about music. For example, headphones could represent music. Music notes could represent music. Actual instruments could represent music. Here is another example, KU basketball. Drawing a basketball could represent an interest in basketball. Drawing the logo of KU could represent your interest. Sneakers could represent your interest. And a basketball goal. These are all logos slash symbols that could be used to represent your interest for KU basketball. 